Liverpool have moved five points clear at the top of the Premier League table courtesy of a 4-0 win over Bournemouth at the Vitality Stadium on Sunday afternoon. Bournemouth came flying out of the traps, with the home side playing the better football early on, and it was not a surprise that they were looking for the informed Dominic Solanc in the final third of the field. There were so many nearly moments for Andoni Rola's side in the opening 15 minutes, but the final pass was not there. And the same can also be said for Liverpool, with the likes of Hota and Nunez wasting possession in dangerous areas outside the Bournemouth box. The first real effort of the match came in the 19th minute from Alexis McAllister, but the World Cup winner strike from outside the box was always moving wide of the post. Nunez tested Bournemouth goalkeeper Neto with a strike from distance in the 25th minute, but it did not have the direction to cause the Brazilian a real problem. Neto made another save in the 34th minute to keep out a long-range strike from Luis Diaz, before Alison Becker kept out an effort from Ryan Christie down the other end of the field five minutes later. A dangerous cross from Justin Kluivert caused problems inside the Liverpool box late in the first period, but there were no takers, before Ibrahim Akinate headed a corner over the crossbar down the other end, and the two teams headed down the tunnel at 0-0. A possible red card for Kluivert was a talking point at the break, with the Dutchman catching Diaz late in the half, but the referee was happy for the play to continue and VAR agreed. Liverpool took the lead early in the second period, with Nunez expertly finding the bottom corner with a cool finish after being found by Hota inside the Bournemouth box. Bournemouth were almost able to answer back immediately through Kluivert but his effort was just deflected wide of the Liverpool goal with Allison committed to his dive. Connor Bradley, on his Premier League debut, then had two chances in quick succession, with his header from a Nunez cross being deflected behind for a corner before his long-range effort from the resulting set-piece was saved by Neto. Liverpool doubled their lead in the 71st minute of the clash, with Hota firing into the near post after being released by substitute Cody Gokpo and it was a real blow for Bournemouth at that stage of the match. Hota scored again in the 79th minute to put the match beyond the home side, with the Portugal international's strike finding a route into the bottom corner at the second time of asking. David Brooks had a chance to give the Bournemouth fans something to cheer late on, but he chipped wide of the post, and Nunez then added his second in the final exchanges, finishing off after a brilliant pass from Joe Gomez. Liverpool will now switch their attention to the second leg of their EFL Cup semi-final against Fulham, which will take place on Wednesday, while Bournemouth will be bidding to bounce back from the disappointing result when they host Swansea City in the fourth round of the FA Cup on Thursday.